Ready? Dun, 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 dun. Jurassic World Super Colossal Tyrannosaurus Rex. You know it's big if it says colossal. What's going on, Coyote Pack? And welcome to a very special episode of Base Camp. Now, you see three giant cardboard boxes here before us. Yeah. And I have to send a big thank you out to Mattel for sending us these products today to review. But before we get into what's in these boxes, let's talk about dinosaurs. Oh, Mario, yeah. I told you to show up today decked out in dinosaur gear. And you did a pretty excellent job. Yeah, I'm wearing my original Jurassic Park shirt. I got my dino cap. What do you got? I am actually wearing my Coyote Saurus what? shirt. Now, you know, we usually review some Coyote Pack fan art. Yep. This is actually a shirt that was made for me by a Coyote Pack member and given to me on the East Coast tour. Today is the first chance that I've had to feature it on camera. That's awesome. Pretty cool, right? Oh, yeah. Absolutely love this shirt. And I'm sure at this point you guys have guessed that inside these boxes from Mattel, who is now producing all of the toys for the Jurassic franchise, mm -hmm. you guessed it guys, they have sent us three boxes of Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom toys. Whoa. For real, for it's real? happening. This is what we're doing. Now people have asked for an unboxing video on the Brave Wilderness channel, right? Yeah, they're popular on YouTube, but we cannot unbox an animal. That doesn't uh, work. Really? Unless we put maybe a box jellyfish inside of a box and unbox it? No, too complicated. Way too complicated, yeah. probably way too dangerous. But Mattel knows how much we love dinosaurs, Absolutely. and specifically the Jurassic franchise. And today, I'm gonna give you for me? a box. That's Ooh. a box for you. This is a box for me. We've got a third giant box down here. We have no idea what's inside the boxes, but we are going to open them up and review these amazing products that Mattel has sent. Now, what I have here is a pocket knife. Just a moment of safety, guys. If you get a package in the mail, Mm -hmm. and you're going to open it with a knife, use the knife safely. Make sure that your parents know what it is that you're doing to open things up with a knife, right? Yeah, yeah. Gotta put a safety disclaimer out there. So if you guys are ready, I know I'm ready. I'm like a kid on Christmas. I can't party. wait, yeah. Let's dive into the boxes. <laughs> Here we go. All right, I'm gonna open this one first. Oh, gotta be careful. A lot of tape there. Let me get this. All right. Now don't, careful, careful, careful. You don't want to damage any of the dinos. Some of these dinos don't need dino damage yet. Remember that from the toys when we were little, they had dino damage? I remember the dino damage. I wonder damage. if any of these new toys have dino damage. That was one of my favorite parts. So what uh, what figures did you have from the original movie? Um, certainly had the T-Rex. Velociraptor was one of my favorite. Um, mm -hmm. I had the Jeep, I had the Explorer. How about you? Yeah, I had the whole command center. Oh, the command <laughs> the center, I forgot stuff. about that. Yeah. The command center was <laughs> super cool. Yeah, I had pretty much every Jurassic toy when I was a kid. I feel like a kid again today. Absolutely. Getting ready to open up my first box. Okay, awesome. you ready? We're yep. getting into this. I can't hold back any further. Oh, look at this! Whoa. Oh my gosh! Spinosaurus, yes! <laughs> Holy cow! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Look how many are inside of your box! This is that. crazy! Okay, let's look at that okay, first. Wait, wait. Uh, so what do, how do we do this? I've never done an unboxing. I never <laughs> have either. I don't know how these unboxing things work, work, but oh my gosh, Mattel, thank you so much for sending us these products to review. My hands are like shaking right now. There are dinosaurs. <laughs> I was afraid this is gonna be a joke and there were gonna be a bunch yeah. of bees that swarmed out. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is crazy. Okay, um, I'm just gonna go for this one first. Okay, go for it. Spinosaurus, nice. look at that. Oh wow, cool. Now this is the Jurassic World Legacy Collection. Yes. Maybe you guys didn't know this, but what Mattel decided to do is also release a Legacy Collection sure. in connection with Fallen Kingdom because we want everybody to know where Jurassic originated from. And in the first three movies, the Spinosaur, as we know, was the main sort of villain dinosaur in Jurassic 3. Yep. And the Legacy series throws back to the 25 year anniversary of the Jurassic Park original film. Yep. Which as we know, came out in 1993. Dude, Spinosaurus, hold That's it. That's awesome. That's the real deal see. right there. What does he do? I don't know. Oh, wow. Look at that. Holy cow, let's see. That's Bite episode. Good. Ah, I'm bit by a Spinosaur. <laughs> Man, that is cool. Holy cow, okay, set that guy over there. We gotta okay. kinda plow through all of what these are to start, and then we'll take a look at some of them up close. All right, dig in, right. what do you got in here? Let's see. Oh, nice. another legacy figure. So people can see it, Dilophosaurus. Dilophosaurus. 
Wow. All right. That's cool. Like, he's got a little bit of the, the venom. In the yeah. movie, they portray them as venomous. Right. Right. And they kind of spat out some venom. Which, as we know, you recreated in that little scene that we did one time. That's right. Yeah. 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 Arm wrestling. Yeah. So, pretty cool. Dilophosaurus. Cool. All right. What do we got here? Let's see. <gasps> Look at that. That's blue. Blue and Dr. Owen. Wow. It actually kind of looks like Chris Pratt. Yeah. That's pretty good. Wow. I'm impressed. Look at this figure. Wow, look at the movements. Completely articulatable head and yeah. arms. How cool is that? Okay, okay, sorry. We've got to dive back into this box here. You got so much stuff in there. Oh, I got some good ones. Uh, hold on, hold on. I got on. some good ones. This is one that I saw <gasps> online. The Thrash and Throw T-Rex. Look at that prehistoric beauty. <laughs> Do that again. <laughs> what? That is amazing. Uh, that's pretty cool. Look at all of the movements and look at the sculpting in those toys. This looks exactly like the T-Rex. That's pretty good sculpting for That sure. is a really yeah. good toy. Oh, look at that. So you, you can control the dinosaur kind of with his tail. Wow, okay, so he can bite, <laughs> grab something, thrash it around. Amazing, Jurassic World. T-Rex, thrash and throw T-Rex, that's incredible. Oh, I got right. some good ones. Oh, you got some good ones in here? Yep. Okay, just start handing them to me. We gotta dun, get dun, through some of these. Dun, 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 dun. Legacy series? Yeah. Legacy series. Oh, man. Dr. Grant. Dr. Sattler. Favorite. And of course, our game warden, Robert Muldoon. <laughs> Clever girl. <laughs> nice, wow, these are awesome. All right, set these over to the side. Uh, let's see what else we, oh, man. Get Ready? into that, go for it. You gotta have a Stegosaurus. Oh! Yes! Is this Look Legacy Series? No, this is just Jurassic World. Yeah, you've yeah. got Stegosaurus in the new Jurassic movies. Wow. Look at all the articulation in these toys. That's the thing that I can't get over. This That's is cool. Crazy. Very, very rubber pliable plates on top, movable legs. Wow, what an awesome toy. Nice. I like the color scheme. Mm hmm. Kind of natural. Stegosaurus. Steggy. All right, what else, what else we got in here? All right. Oh, this is cool. Yeah, got that's, that's pretty the, cool. The little figures. This is a new thing that they did. They came out with these mini dino action figures and actually oh, also these. sent us a bunch of these. I love these. Now, we have seen these at a number of different stores. We have. And yep. I got to admit, guys, every time we <laughs> see one, we buy them. When we are in location, we do sort of our like supply, supply shopping or something. at yep. a store and we see these, we pick one up. What's cool about them is, is people love what are called blind boxes. Where let's open one up. You don't know what's inside it. Yeah, well, let's definitely open one up. So it looks like a dinosaur egg. Check that out. And you open this up and see which one you get. Oh, oh. nice. Cephalosaurus. Look at that. Oh, it's blue. It's blue. Nice. nice. Ah! Ah. Although the size doesn't compare exactly accordingly, but wow, this is super cool. Yeah, look at all Ooh, the ones Oh, it's got a little get. collection sheet. Let's see. Oh, that's cool. So you can open this up and it's a checklist and you can check off all of the dinosaurs that you nice. can find. Ooh, Indominus Rex is out there somewhere. Oh, I bet we, that one is pretty rare. Man, look at, all, look at all the ones we got. We've got a bunch of them. All right. I'll save that towards the end of the episode. The all right, side. put those off to the side. Now this is cool because those little eggs, you can also buy the Legacy Series collection and I believe there are a couple different sets of this. So if you don't like just getting the little blind bags, you can buy them. Yeah. I, I love that they These give you that opportunity. These are fun though. These are definitely fun. They're my favorite. Great yeah. stocking stuffers, yeah. right? For this holiday season, that's what All I'm right. thinking. Ooh, oh, look at this guy. Oh, what's that? That's another figure. Oh, oh, that's Baby Blue. Oh, and Dr. Owen, let me see. Yeah. Cool, well that's pretty neat because this was actually seen in Fallen Kingdom, yep. where they had the little globe thing, and Owen was facing off with this, the Carnotosaurus, right? Carnotosaurus, yep. Let's see, let's see what he can do. Oh, oh, he's got that's pretty cool. That's pretty sweet. His mouth opens all the way up. Nice. Right? Oh yeah, look at that. Whoa. This was definitely like kind of a new dinosaur that they featured in yeah. this movie. And um, here's a little tidbit in the Lost World book. They did have one of these dinosaurs featured. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and it was really ominous. It's always sort of been in the background in the Jurassic yeah. franchise, but didn't make its appearance until Fallen Kingdom. Correct. Which is super cool. And this is great. Look at the detail in Baby Blue there. Zoom in on that. What a great little tiny toy. How cool is that? They absolutely thought of everything. Man, good job, Mattel. All right, what about your box? What else you got there? I got something pretty big here. I, I wasn't going to reveal it quite yet. All right, I'm going to move. I'm gonna bring this up. I'm gonna okay. just put this box off to the side over here. 
Check it out. Whoa. That is the Mosasaur the right Mosasaur, there. Mosasaur, yeah. Wow, what an epic toy. Right. This yeah. is great. It's squishy rubber. Ooh, oh, this man. may be a candidate for my open yeah. at the end. We'll, we'll, we'll wait. Let's okay. keep moving. All right, well, Put this let's, guy just, here. let's just get these guys out. Yeah, we got give me a couple. Triceratops right there. He's got a little bit of battle damage. Look, look, here's the battle damage. Remember oh, that? nice. They did do dino damage. Oh, they call it battle damage. Now it was dino, dino damage, damage when I was a yeah. kid. Sweet. Triceratops. Here's a, another variation of blue. Gallimimus. It's a Gala, 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 Gala I'm done with right, this one. Get that box out of the way. The moment we have all been waiting for, guys. <laughs> I have a feeling I know what's in here. But I don't know at the same time. I'm okay. really hoping. I'm really hoping for, the, for this one thing because if they did send it, somebody out there in the audience is going to get it. Okay. There's more in here than I whoa. thought there was going to be. Hold on a second. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's this T-Rex? That's another T-Rex. Whoa. I didn't even know they were making Ooh. this. Look at this, Jurassic World Legacy Collection T-Rex. Rexy, right? That's what they call her. Yeah, awesome. Oh, 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 hold on. Oh, I know what you're looking at. Just go ahead, grab it, all grab right. it. I'm trying to get these all stacked up here. So it's, it's, it's clear that this is a big part of the second movie, right? <sighs> the Indoraptor. Yes. Look at that guy. What a villain. Oh my gosh. That was some of my favorite parts of that movie. And was... some of the homages to the original Jurassic Park movie and the way that some of the scenes yeah. played out and the movements of this creature. Yeah, I oh think they did a gosh. great job with just the, the way this animal looks. I think this is definitely a candidate for possibly yeah, opening I think as well. So. Okay, yeah. Indoraptor. <laughs> yes, thank you guys for sending us the Indoraptor. When we opened up that first box, I was like, oh, no Indoraptor? We have to feature the Indoraptor. But look at this. What? One of the new vehicles. Gyrosphere Blast Vehicle. <laughs> Does this actually like launch this thing? I think it does. <laughs> oh man, we're not gonna get any work done today. We're gonna be playing with these toys for the rest of the yep. day. Th look rest at this, there week. are more boxes inside of the box. Bubble wrap. Hold on a second. What is that? Jurassic World Chomp and Roar. Oh my gosh, Mario, do you know what this is? No. You know, you have the Dilophosaurus mask, right? Yeah. Wait till you see what this is. Look, grab those hands. There's some hands in there. What the? Check this out. Yes! Look! I saw this at a store. <laughs> yes! Look at that! Oh, man. Are you serious? <laughs> so now you've got the hands and the raptor mask. We know uh, Mario has this Dilophosaurus mask that he's had since he was a little kid. Yeah. <laughs> we finally were able to use it in, in that little promo video for the arm wrestling thing. Whoa. That's crazy. Okay, well, I know what you're gonna be for <laughs> Halloween this year. There you go. Whoa! Check this out. What's that? I'm just gonna like, have these on the whole time. Oh, and check it out. We've got two of each. What? I have a feeling that this is going to be a part of what's coming at the end of this video. Look at this, you pull the string and these things take off <laughs> and run. So you can have Dr. Owen chasing blue. Do you want to take, you're going to keep the dinosaur hands on? I kind of want of to. You should try. Keep them on. All right, I'm putting these guys over here. Oh, guys, it's like Woo! the holidays. It's like your birthday all combined into one Jurassic World story pack. I don't know right, what I that take is. I'm going to take this off for now. You know what made this amazing is that this was a box filled with more boxes. Yeah, that's pretty. So this is like a super unboxing. Yes. Right? Because there's like one, two, three, four, like. 10 boxes. Uh, yes please. <laughs> Check that out. Velociraptor, Dr. Woo! Owen, and Claire with a gyrosphere. Sphere. Gyrosphere. Gyro. Gyrosphere and Claire. I'm glad to see that Bryce Dallas Howard now yeah. has her own toy too. All right. You know, like it's it's important. You have to have, and that's what I loved about the first Jurassic toys that Mattel definitely paid attention to this time around as well, is that you have male characters and female characters. Sure. You've got something for everybody. Oh, yes. Oh, another Gallimimus. Oh, all right. Can't have too many oh, of those. Oh, look at this Velociraptor. That one's different. That's a green raptor. Ooh, 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 ooh. Attack pack. Dimorphodon, one of your favorites. Oh, yes. That look one's at going that. in your office. And ooh, another blue Velociraptor. Wow. We've got a like, a coyote. We, we, we have basically a raptor pack. We have a raptor pack now. Yeah. We have made it down to the last item. 
inside of this box. It's big. It's real big. <laughs> it is! This is it! This is it! Now, when the new Jurassic toys were announced, mm -hmm. I went online months ago. I think it was February. And I wanted to see what they were releasing. Yep. And they announced the largest Tyrannosaur toy ever in the franchise. I did get a sneak peek as well. I was doing my research. Ready? Dun, 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 dun. Jurassic World Super Colossal Tyrannosaurus Rex. You know it's big if it says Colossal. This is the biggest T-Rex <laughs> toy that has ever been made. All right, watch yourself, Mario. Got yep. the knife coming toward you Go for it. And let us reveal to the Coyote Pack the one toy. Thank you, Mattel, for sending this. This was the one thing that I hoped they would send. Oh, hold that. Here we yep. go. Go for it. Coming out. Oh my Ooh. goodness. Colossal. Look at that ah. T-Rex. <laughs> wow. That is a heavy toy. <laughs> Let me see. Oh my gosh. That is huge. That thing is giant. Now what is cool about this, oh. look at the size of its head. You could fit your whole arm in there. What is yeah. so cool about this Tyrannosaur is you put it together, you attach the tail, the yep. legs are kind of buried back in here. This can actually eat the other action figures. Really? How cool is that? The Mattel thought, you know what people want to do with their toy dinosaurs? Eat things. Of course, that's eat what the they other do. action figures. Yeah. You can actually put the action figures down through this Tyrannosaur's mouth, and then it comes out the dinosaur's backside. It poops it out. Oh yeah, I'm, we're gonna be technical about it. Yeah, the T-Rex yeah. can then poop out the action figures. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right guys, so this was epic. What we're gonna do now is cut the cameras. We're gonna clean up some of this chaos, display yep. the toys, and then we're each going to pick one thing that we're going to have unboxed and okay. display to you guys and review in full detail. I mean, this would be a two hour video if True. we reviewed everything. And so I have much. a good feeling that some of these items might show up in an upcoming series that's gonna be released on the Brave Wilderness channel. It is an adventure 65 million years in the making. That's mm. all I will say about it now, but stay tuned guys, because this fall, the Brave Wilderness channel is going dinosaurs. All right, let's cut the cameras, reset, and take a look at these toys. All right. <laughs> all right guys, and we are back, and now you see the ones that we chose to fully unbox. Yep. We were gonna film all of that, and they were really well packed in there, weren't they? They sure were, yeah. Mario, tell us what you unboxed. I unboxed the Indoraptor, and uh, the reason why is uh, I really like this character in the movie. It was kind of the villain, and this figure is just so articulated. Look, it's got all these joints, and can it, can uh, it bite? yeah, it could bite. Ah. Uh, what was cool is in the movie, it would sometimes like stand up on on its two legs, mm -hmm. and then it crouch down like on all fours. So I don't know, I, th I just really like the color scheme of this, and you picked? I had to go with the Mosasaur. It is so epic. This may that's be impressive. the best Jurassic toy, in my opinion, that's ever been made. Feel it, it is completely rubber. Oh yeah. Feels like the back of an alligator, and look how big yeah. it is. Now, <laughs> we, we saw that it was in pieces in the box, and at first I was concerned, oh, how is that gonna snap together? Is it mm -hmm. gonna work well? It's amazing, those flippers, snap right in and they fully move and look at the mouth. Whoa, that's huge. Oh, gotcha. That is like the head. That's as big as the head of the, the alligator, alligator that I, mean, I got chomp on. From the top, that looks like an alligator right there. Look at all those scutes and osteoderms. So cool. <laughs> now what's great about this is I think you could probably even take this in your swimming pool. Why not? Or take it yeah. out to the beach with you. Um, because it has enough porous ability, you can then dump the water out. You sure. don't want water to form mold inside of a toy, but this is an epic That's toy. and. One. Oh, <laughs> smells like a Jurassic toy. So cool, look at the underside. Even the detail in the belly of this creature. That's impressive. I mean, I used to carry my 1993 T-Rex around with me all the time. I think this is gonna be my new carry around he wherever I go. He still carries that dinosaur around. I do, does. I've actually taken that T-Rex yeah. to some very important meetings with yeah. me as influence. Nice. Wow, That's a good very one. cool. If we could, we would have fully unboxed every single one of these toys, but it would have taken us hours. And if you are still here watching now, everybody give a huge shout out and thank you to Mattel for sending us these products to review. Nice. From the bottom of my heart, guys, this has been one of the coolest things <laughs> I've ever had the chance to do. But because we love the Coyote Pack so much, mm -hmm. this is the moment where we say, 
if you write in the comments section below, tell us how the Jurassic franchise has influenced or touched your life in some way, why you love these movies, yep. and more specifically, how you think you would use the colossal T-Rex to create a scene or whatever might be in your bedroom, your backyard, you name it, we are giving away the colossal nice. T-Rex to one Ooh. lucky member of the Coyote Pack. Now, what's really cool about the Jurassic franchise and its toys is that when I was a kid and had all the original toys, mm -hmm. I used to set up scenes in my bedroom or in my backyard and actually practice some of my early filming techniques that then, of course, influenced the work on the Brave Wilderness Absolutely, channel. Absolutely, yeah, that's cool. It's a great way for kids to use your imagination and just play around with these wonderful toys. Um, and I think that kind of brings us to the end of the episode, right? What about the giveaway? Well, yeah, the giveaway. Guys, remember, write yeah. in the comments section below for your chance to win this colossal sized T-Rex and a couple of these other items. And again, a big thank you to Mattel for sending us these amazing boxes of items to review and feature here on the Brave Wilderness channel. Feel like a little kid again. Me too. Uh, I think we're pretty much going to spend the rest of the day playing with these toys, aren't we? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah. Hopefully an episode's going to come out this week. I'm Coyote Peterson. I'm Mario Nicola. Be brave. Stay wild. We'll see you on the next Base Camp Adventure. Roar! Ah, I got my eye! Wow, this Indoraptor is super cool. Oh, hey, Blue. What's going on, girl? Hey, have a seat. Have a seat. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Blue! Click, 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 click! You know me. Yeah, good raptor. Here we go. Ah! Oh, no! Hey, Coyote Pack! If you want to go on a prehistoric adventure back in time, make sure to check out the episode where we traveled into the backcountry of Utah to find dinosaur tracks. And don't forget, subscribe so you can join me and the crew on our next big adventure.